Yeah, I went to the cleaners to get my clothes. The lady told me $68. It wasn't but two outfits and one was a three-piece. I didn't complain. That was her price. I should have asked before I left my clothes. You know, I take my lick and I don't complain about shit. But what I did was, I said, let me go back old school, goddammit. See, I'm from the South, shit. We ain't lazy, and we don't have the money. So, this is what I did. I went straight to the damn store after I left the cleaners and bought me a cheap iron. Because I don't have to iron that much. Because when I wash, I take my shit right out of the dryer and take them out neatly and quickly hang them up. So, I went back old school. Anybody remember this? Oh, I know you 21st ki uh, kids. Y'all don't, don't know nothing about this shit right here. Y'all think this is Lysol. Lys yeah, these kids look at this and say this is Lysol. They ain't never seen this shit. Because they'll go wrinkle and proud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I went to the cleaner. And I didn't like my bill. So I said, what you going to do about it? <laughs> yeah, that's what I did. I went to Target, goddamn. Now, this is not Lysol. This is starch. Go find some of that starch in that damn red box. You know, when you used to do your jeans and soak it in that damn argyle starch and iron them damn jeans and they would stand up. <laughs> Back in the days. When shit was much better than it is now. I ain't never seen this damn country so fucked up. And white folks getting ready to go to work on Joe Biden. He did it first. I didn't vote for him because I knew he was crooked. All of them is. Barack ain't going to do no shit like that. I put my neck on the chopping block. Barack ain't going low.